Well, we are more than a month into the new year, and so here's the question. Have you been keeping up with those fitness resolutions? Uh, yeah, well, that's not the answer to that. Maybe you're uh, lacking motivation. So Tim <laughs> is here to tell us how you, we, all of us can use our phones to get back on track. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hey, good morning, guys. There are plenty of fitness tracker apps out there. So I spoke with Jim White of Jim White's Fitness and Nutrition Center to find out which ones are best for keeping your eye on the prize. Let's face it, at the end of the day when we're tired and worn down from a long day and the options are take a nap or work out, most times than not we'll opt for the nap. Motivation when embarking on a fitness goal is key and there are apps out there to make that journey a bit easier. I mean, I think technology, we have to embrace it these days. It keeps our energy up, it motivates us, it provides that accountability. Here's just a few. JFit offers a database of structured workouts for strength and conditioning, contests to reward your progress and timed workouts, making sure you get in that time either at the gym or at home. Up next, Diet Bet. This is a weight loss challenge. Typically, you try and lose anywhere from 4 to 12% of your body weight, and you can win actual money. This is, as you can imagine, extremely motivational. Studies show that if we um, actually keep to these apps and track our progress when it comes to our workouts and our food, we can become 30% more adherent uh, to exercise and nutrition. Lose It is another weight loss motivator. This is built on the power of social media and can almost be thought of as crowdfunded weight loss. Friends from your network help motivate you to reach your goals. Time is usually a big deterrent for getting into a routine. That's why Seven was developed. It's a database of seven minute workouts. Now there's no excuses. But what about cost? See, I, I recommend start with the free app and you know, try for a month or two. If it's something you like, see what those actual add-ons are. And if, if it's an app you like, I would go for it. Now, as you can imagine, we've only hit on a few of the apps that are available out there. But one I want to talk about is uh, making working out a little bit easier if you get paid to do it. There's an app <laughs> called Gym Pact. It lets you make a pact with yourself to uh -huh. remain accountable. If you break it, yeah, you're going to get charged <laughs> but if you keep it your balance does grow so you can make money if you stick to your plan i like that huh keeps you accountable yeah yeah that's interesting it's really yeah. cool i have to see how much money you make though I, I did it for a couple months and you make like 20 bucks a month that's which, I more mean, than really? what yeah. you had right it's like a dollar it's like less than a dollar or so a workout but it's hey it's something stick it right, right into it. that vending machine right. over here. <laughs> <laughs> no. free pizza <laughs> good great thank anyway, you tim appreciate the yeah. effort that was cool and we're going to be doing this whole thing all week long so yes. tomorrow i'm going to be looking at some apps to help with a busy schedule mm. there you go nice. that too thank mm -hmm. you